Hello, and welcome back to this Nino Kuni Wrath of the White Witch. Let's play with me, SLJRPG. In the last episode, we finally used the gateway spell after receiving the spellbook and the wand to get to this rather mystical looking land where our good friend Drippy came from. After getting here, we aimed to go to the nearest settlement but could not get in because the guard had lost his heart, seemingly part of the evil big bosses plan to steal everyone's hearts in this nation, and we are told by Drippy to head towards the old, to go see the old man of the woods in the deep dark wood. Um, what I have done since I've seen you last, as I have, I can't even show you the status of me right now, but I have leveled myself up to level 4. Um, again, a couple of coins, got some loot, that kind of thing, but I think without further ado, let's head into the deep dark wood and see what the fuck is up. The Deep Dark Wood, the Forest of the Fairy Tales. Oh god, it's been it's been a couple of days. Look that way, that's the waystone. They're useful, they are. A waystone? Yes, man, they're these ancient stones, see, and you can use them to store and record your adventures so far. In wild places like forests and so on, you can just plunk yourself down in on the nearest rock and write your story down. Why not? Why not, he says. Give me strength, man. Because they're crawling with horrible beasties, ain't it? They are? Sounds kind of scary. You'll get used to it, man. Just don't remember, you can't go record your progress any old way. So, in the... Allow me to explain this a little bit more. Touch a waystone and your health and magic power will be fully restored. Not bad. Not all. These little beauties also let you save your progress. They save allow you to save progress specifically in... Um, dungeon areas, I do believe so. Which is why you should stop every waystone you see and make use of it. Better safe than sorry, ain't it? Sure thing, Mr. Jerpy. Tidy. That's what we'd like to hear. Let's hope you're as good as your word. All right, next up, the old man of the woods. Here we go. So let's make sure we go and grab this. The thing next to it is something I think we can't actually do quite yet. Which is fine, but. We need to make our way through the old woods. As we're coming to a little cross section here. I want to go down here first. Where are you going, man? He's right nearby. Of course he is. So we have to head this way. Also, again, undeniably very beautiful. Mr. Drippy! Wait for me! Who goes there? Jeepers. Ollie boy, meet old Father Oak. How do you, a leafiness? Oh, Drippy, it's you. And to what do I owe the pleasure? Well, I got a visitor by her from another world, see? And what it is is, I was wondering if you might lend us a bit of a hand, like. Oh, I should have known. You only ever come to see me when you are in need. Sorry, your tall ship. You know I'm always very grateful. Hmm. This boy... Ah, Looks like a duck. did it, did you, you bark ship? Well, well. The pure-hearted one. He who will drive out the darkness. And if he, you mean to... That's right, your ancient ship. We're off to give Shadar a right royal hiding. You? Why? <laughs> as reckless as ever, I see. Very well. You shall have my aid. Of course. But first, we had better give the boy a familiar, had we not? Oh, yeah! Clean forgot I did. He's right, Dolly boy. It might be a bit early, but I suppose we better teach you how to conjure up familiars, innit? Familiars? Yeah, familiars. Which? You're in our world, you can magic up little fighting creatures from your heart, see? They're called familiars. Where we're going, the beasties are only gonna get bigger and meaner. So, you're gonna need a helping hand, or claw, or beak, or tentacle. Can I really do it? Well, there's only one way to find out. You want to help your mom, don't you? Uh, sure I do. Well then, 
Grab your wizard's companion and turn to the page marked Form Familiar. Nice. So we're going to do another spell. But Mr. Drippy, there's no spell named Form Familiar here. You what? The boy is correct. Look at the wizard's companion. It would seem that it's missing more than a few pages. Really? Nickers. So does that mean I can't cast the spell? I am not as powerless as all that, young man. Oliver, was it? Let me see. Form familiar. Ah, yes. A gift from me to you, young Oliver. The old man of the woods is granting us a spell. So this is where the monster collecting comes in. You received a page describing the form familiar spell. Thank you very much, Old Father Elk. But simply possessing the page for a particular spell is no guarantee you'll be able to make use of it. Some spells are simply not meant for certain wizards. Such is life. Don't worry about it for now, man. Just give form familiar a go, will you? Sure thing, Mr. Drippy. Form familiar. Look at that! A warrior from your very own heart! A familiar! This is a familiar? That's right! The fighting spirit inside you made flesh! A soldier of your soul! And he can really help me fight? Huh? A cute little boy. Ouch! That was a mean trick! And the stronger you get, the harder he's gonna hit as well! <laughs> Wow. Oh. So our first one, I do believe, is called Might. So this is your familiar, huh? And he'll be coming with us. Indeed he will, Ollie boy. The more the merrier, ain't it? Here, yeah, you better give the little fellow a name, eh? We call him, call him Mighty. Because we go cannon. Are you sure you want to call him the Might Mighty? I certainly do. We cannot set you off into the wild with only that with it wand in your hand. Let me give you some spells to aid. The first is restorative incantation known as healing touch. Received healing touch. Cure, as I may call it. Or store wounds. Tidy, that's the most useful spell there is for wandering it for the wandering adventure. Got some bruises, sprains, gashes, all gone in a jiffy with healing touch, you see. Gee, you make it sound like I'm gonna hurt an awful lot, Mr. Trippy. Next I give you the gist of the blazing inferno. Fireball. Shoots a little more fire, that one does. Plant based species, Philippine native fireman. Even if, if even tree face here is a little scared of fireball. How dare you? You would never aim such a spell at me, would you, boy? Golly, of course not, Mr. Father Elk. You received the fireball spell. Nice. Now, boy, now I can press X at any time to open up a spells menu. While well, spell like healing touch can be used any time, fireball is meant primarily for use in battle. That being said, the most unexpected spells can prove incomparably useful given the right set of circumstances. Novel problems call for novel solutions after all. If you find yourself at something of a loss, I recommend that you go through your, your magical repertoire. You never know what spell might save the day. You can now use the spells menu. Oh. Uh-oh. Huh? Spoiling for a fight, is it? Better give him what he wants, Solly boy. Huh? But what do I do? Just think what you want him to do and he'll do it. It's as easy as falling off a log, man. Okay. Just think what I want him to do. Here goes. And here we go, our fast first fight with our new familiar. Let's go! Right, early boy, it's time to learn about fighting with familiars. First off, you've got to pick who's going to fight to, oh, out of you and your little friend. We've gone to the trouble of making him, so let's give him a go. Select him, will you not? So we can't choose Oliver, but we can choose the mighty. Let's send him into the fray, shall we? Oh, see that circle on top left? That's his mini stamina gauge. It shows how much longer he can fight for. See, the longer you keep him go, the shorter his stamina gauge will get. When it's empty, that means the ball lad's so tired he can can't fight anymore. Tragic. So that happens, call him back to you to get a bit of rest, like. Something else about familiars you should know. This little mark there, it's a sign. 
You can see a sign there. Is that typing? Sort of like a star sign, except there's only four of them. Sun, moon, star, and planet. And the star signs, different ones get on better. You can use that to help you in battle. Let's talk about tricks. They're proper powerful abilities, like your spells. These spells cost MP to use. You can use cost written next to them. Okay. Barge of random slashes, just physical attacks. We share him HP. Through MP, and HP they'll suffer. So. You need to swap him regularly. Anytime you can do that by pressing LB. Okay. So she's cut loose. Just he's not done it yet. Nice. Then attack. So basically, I think we can swap into different people. For different points. Okay, I'm going to try and get this back. We'll take all of the health we can get. Yeah, basically we can now switch out in teams. We have ourselves a little, little, little man to help us. And it's only level 2. Mighty Reach is level 2. Oh, so, so now you know how to fight with the familiar enter, dolly boy. To be a true contender, you'll need to learn what, when to let your familiar loose and when to take control of yourself. I'll do my best, Mr. Drippy. Oh, and when he's not fighting, the little fellow can be found taking it easy in the creature cage. In the creature cage, show you have truthful, faithful familiars with delicious treats. All kinds of cheese to choose from. Some will improve their abilities, and others that can teach, even teach them new tricks. Tidy. Feed the little blighters enough of what they fancy, and the bonds of familiarity between you will grow. I mean, you can boost their abilities even more. Careful not to pump them too full of sweets, though. They'll only help getting full up. Adoration and moderation is the key. It's probably a lot for your head to get through, but just remember that the creature cage is where you look after your familiars. Take it from there, ain't it? The creature cage, got it. Perhaps look after him real well, Mr. Drippy. Oh, I almost forgot. We had something we wanted to ask you, your tr trunkiness. Here's a guard down, Ding Dong Dell, and he's a broken hearted, see? Broken hearted, you say? She does evil spreads still further. So will you be needing that we will you are okay chewed. Very quick you are. You still have a you still got it, ain't you? Patience, young Trippy, of course I have. Let me see now. Ah, it's in here somewhere. Crikey, you've not gone and lost it, have you? Lost it to the insolence. But it's safely where most of my uppermost branches. It's a little tangled up there, that's all. While I seek it out, I have a favour to ask ask you. Did I mention we're in a flipping hurry? Didn't I? We haven't got time to go. Mr. Drippy, we should help him. Mount Father Elk, he gave us those spells, didn't he? How oh, refreshing to meet a young person responsible. A responsible and honest young man. Alright, alright, I get the flipping message. What do you need us for, eh? Well, the Guardian these words, you see. The Guardian. What's up with the old fellow? The afraid he has become rather unruly as of late. He's neglecting his duties. Well, 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 it's no good, is it? We better help you sort him out then, eh? The Guardian, he sounds kind of tough. To your ideas, he's way stronger than your average beastie. But you got a familiar on your side now, man. You'll be fine. And besides, if you're going to take down Shida, you can't hold back a bit of light Guardian bashing now, can you? Okay, I'll do it. A very kind. The Guardian can be found in the deepest part of the wood, beyond the Whispering Waterfalls. I wish you luck. First spells, now familiars. You're turning into a proper wizard now, ain't you, early boy? I guess I am, huh? Now then, why don't you take a constant look at your new mate here? How do I do that, Trippy? He's a great man, listen up. So I made many friends and familiars. Find sort of just about you and your familiar's abilities. It's a bit complicated, fair few options can come there. To be fair, soon you'll get the hang of it, man. You certainly will. You must need luck. So keep fighting monsters and you'll get you call that leveling up. We already did that. You probably want to make some new mates before long, so be sure to take a look at them. I've shared you. Friends and Families is now accessible from the main menu. So Friends and Familiars, we've got your boy here. We're in the creature cage. Should I try and give him pie? We got this pie in uh Nice, and I took his accuracy up, so 
We'll definitely do that. As you can see, everyone kind of gets a team of three, so, and there's going to be more, more people that can bring along people with us. But for right now, it's just me and old Mighty Boy. Um, which, you know, he has fine, he's good. So, we need to try and make our way towards this guardian of the forest. Which... Takes us back out of here, is that the idea? Ah, it's that place where we were trying to go last time, but we were unable to. Okay. Well, as we found to us ourselves our first chest. Boom. A little a white loaf of bread. Who doesn't love that? Right. We've yet to see any enemies of some kind. You would think there would be more enemies here. Also, obviously, this music slaps. Does it not? Okay, beyond the waterfall. The whispering waterfalls. I bet you on your wally boy. It's absolutely crawling with monsters beyond here. Carefully you don't go bef go get got before you get to the guardian, eh? I'll be fine, Mr. Trippy. Have the familiar to help me now. That's where you are. Don't forget, though. If the going gets rough, don't be afraid to cast healing touch. I'm sure I won't. I recommend that, but all three days told you. The spells menu is a mere tap of the X away. To try to familiarize yourself with the main menu too while you're at it. Don't worry, I don't want to break anything. No matter what you press. So how about you have a good old poke around and that? When you learn new skills and that, the new options will come up in the main menu. Let's give your eyes pill to make most of your new toys. And what kind of accent is this, Jeepers? So much to remember. You'll get used to it soon though, are you man? Now, now. Past the whistling waterfalls and onto the guardian of the woods we go. Right, let's get back to normal. Let's help him go. Let's go help him get back to normal. What's he gonna say here? Don't forget to have a nice around some treasure chest. Okay, four familiar. We've got healing touch here. And this is all of them. And we've got fireball. And this also heals. But I don't think we're going to need to do that right away. Especially as we've got ourselves a nice little way healing point. We're not going to go ahead and save. But we need to ideally, ideally, get some levels on some people. But we're going to have to fight anyway. So. I want to see fireball. Uh, let's go for you first. Spell, fireball, the blooper. Nice. Then we're going to attack the spitto. And then we can swap like so. Ah, nice. And so I think in my first time, weirdly, I uh, spent a lot of my time uh Annoyingly, uh, annoyingly, spend a lot of my time not using Ollie at all, which I'm going to try and make sure I do this time around. The aim is definitely before we go anywhere. There's a cake there. Uh, let's go and make sure we heal straight back up. I am not, I'm not too proud to use that. Problem is, Ollie's a little bit weak in the old physical attack right now. Um, so he's not the most ideal person to be attacking with. But there we go. Right. Mighty, mighty, mighty. I'm worried I didn't pick up everything I could have picked up in the outside area as well. So before I head back to Ding Dong Dell. Right, let's grab that. Ooh, a chocolate bar. Uh, I'm trying to make sure he's all okay. Nice. And then this one will increase the magical attack. I don't think this is as important. But anything I can get to make him slightly better, I'm going to use. So we attack the platoon here, as we get the advantage as well, which is always handy. Let's go! 
Let's do this. And then cut. Oh. Okay, I need to get used to the... I need to get used to the... What I should be doing. I need to figure out what the button is actually to do stuff. At some point. Nice, take him out for one. Nice, I'm me I think I'm messing up the whole... Uh, I think I'm honestly messing up the... Because I'm recording him back and I didn't want to. There we go, level three for Mighty Boy. Which is very, very good. That feels like it should be a certain place that we go to. Okay, right, as we come to a fork in the road. Right. I'm curious about this one. Oh, there's something to fight though, so we're gonna keep on fighting. Wind snap and spittoon. Right. How do I... So I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna... Oh, see, I'm doing the wrong one. That's the issue. I'm not doing exactly what I wanted. Nice. Oh, that's one down. Take this platoon here. Oof. Ten. My lord, I should use the healing spell soon. I like how he looks like Ollie slightly. Uh, so I'm actually going to use... Actually, let's use our spell. Healing touch. Nice. Make sure it's done. There is a chest this way, however. Seems to be concealed by some kind of magic. Okay, so it's a chest I cannot open yet. I do really like how beautiful this game is, though. Ooh. I'm not sure exactly how well received it was when it came out, but it's undeniably aesthetic. Crikey, I knew there was something I forgot to tell you about, familiars. What's that? Important only boys to listen carefully, alright? Show child familiars can use tricks, didn't I? Well, as well as the little fellows get stronger, they'll start learning new ones. So, tricks familiars in the menu, friends familiar in the menu. Tricks are different from magic, each and every trick falls to a single command, you see? Press Y and friends familiars and change the command select use for tricks. From here, can only remember a maximum of 8 tricks at any given time. When there's only one, you have to make sure to forget one of their old ones. It's a bit of a pain, but at least you can teach them familiar new tricks. There we go. Okay, so, let's have a quick look to see at that. Blades, shields, stuff. We'll, we'd love to do that. Uh, tricks is with Y. Cuddly's here. Uh, he's not yet learnt his new... He's learnt that at level 5, Sandblast. So we're going to have to wait a second. But that's the idea. So they learn stuff. Which I think we kind of gathered anyway. Uh, okay, here was the one we must have seen. So let's go ahead and grab this. Chest. Grab the chest. Oh, another loaf of white bread. There we go, right. It's only going to be something this way. It's just the way we're meant to be going. Okay, they've not, not decreed it yet. But I would like to make sure that I don't forget anything. There's a tree here. Nice, grab this. An iced coffee. Seems like we may be a little bit too young for that. But there we go, right. I'm going to fight immediately. I didn't even see what thing we're going to be fighting. A Jabba. Let's do it. Jabba. Uh, let's go for... Uh, let's try Ollie first. Spells. Fireball to the Whippersnapper. Nice. Let's swap you back in. And then have Mighty just attack the Jabba. Oh, 
Feels like a fairly even fight. Nice. Go on, Jabber. Nice. Level four. And a Sunday. Okay. I want to make sure I defeat everything, to be honest. But I do also want to make sure that he's getting all of the treats he might need. He's also nowhere near full right now. Nice. So any treats we get, he's eating immediately. Alright, let's try and take out this Snapple. Teeny Boo playing a Spitu. We'll go here. here goes. And then we'll get loose immediately. Then attack the Spitu for one, two. And then attack again. Nice. Grab that healing. Cute little muddy boy. Level five. And a sandwich. Anything new, he's getting fed. Because... Oh, well, can't he sandwich, sandwich one of mine? Interesting. It is. I've also got iced coffee as MP. Sandwich is 100. 30 HP for the white bread. It kind of makes sense. I want to make sure I... Have a little search and make sure I get everything here. So I want to make sure he's at the best possible level. So I'm going to see these whippersnappers. I'm going to come, come in. I'm going to start with Ollie. Boom. And then use Fireball onto the whippersnapper. Boom. And then we're going to go... Dan, Dan, and then bring out Mighty to attack like so. Boom, boom. Nice. Grab this one. Splatooning. Nice. And he is a level four. Mighty level four. Right. Just to make sure I clear the map. So I think that should bring me fairly close. Even the like little hop animations. Also, it just goes to show, cell shaded is just a, a, an image which undeniably a graphical style that just holds up so well over a long amount of time. Or well, maybe I'm just bugging. I would love to know what this is. We have to use one of these one day. Maybe we will. HP is restored. We're not going to save our progress. I think we're just going to go ahead, ahead and just straight away. Um, so we're going to just head straight towards the forest. Which I have a feeling we're probably going to do with Oliver because the fireball is going to be the most effective. But there we go, right. Hold up, Ollie boy. What is it? Listen, man, someone's coming. But I don't. It's the freaking guardian, man. It's him. All the tree snippers run away. Yeah, big old fucking boy. The Guardian of the Woods. Okay. We're going to start with Ollie. And we need spells, fireball. Boom. Fireball again. Nickers, do success, Ollie Boy. Let's defend yourself. Okay, so we're going to have to defend here. Only hit for a five. Okay. Sadie, defending against Big Mother's Sad Boy, a nice bonus. It looks like he's doing a big old one that we need to go ahead and do. We're going to try and fight with a little bit of Mighty for right now. Uh, defend. Okay, I'm not sure what that did. 
defend just because I want to see animation. Nice, okay. Look at he lumps the gun and knocked himself out. Give him a proper wall of you see. I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do a combat immediately. It only hits him for nine, however, which is slightly annoying. Try and give him a bit more of a walloping. Okay, and I'm gonna go with Mighty to try and retain a bunch of these healing stuffs for ourselves. Attack, one, two. Stop this, we're gonna go defend. Okay, we need to swap him out to Ollie, that's fine. Defend. Now we're gonna do a fireball. Try and grab some MP back. Defend. Nice. Cool. And this one we're just gonna do spells, fireball. Then we're just gonna attack regularly. Bam. Okay, cancel that. I don't wanna get hit too much. The golden gleam. Alright, I stole you all the HP for you. Do a miracle move if you don't use any. Where is it? Where is it? Where's the golden glim? Okay. God, stop. Move the left. Supercharged. Burning heart. So that's how big boy fights go. Now normally that would get us an achievement, but I've already played that bit before. And that should, however, give us a bunch of levels up, which is good. We get the Spirit of the Woods item. Level up to level 6. Mighty Learned Sound Blast. So we'll equip that. You obtain the blaze describing the guardian of the woods. Nice. Crikey, that was a close sounding thing, man. The guardian, he headed towards the deepest part of the wood. Jake, he's back to normal now. Your guess is as good as mine, man. But that weird look in his eyes said God at least. I reckon he'll probably take some time out to get his head together. Then... I'll get right back to the old guardianing. Well, what made him go all screwy like that? You don't think it was? Gossip was flipping was. She, as she had written all over it. You best watch our uh, backs if you visit any more forests. Saying that, you you get guardians everywhere. Anyway, we did what we came to do. We best get back to see your tree face, eh? Sure, let's go. Ollie boy. So, a Serenity of the Gunningwood's Heart has unlocked a story in the Wizard's Companion. A new tale of wonder. The second tale, the Squirrels and the Bramble. I mean, we'll take it all. Mm. You did well to come, the Guardian of the Woods. And I found what I was looking for. But first, a gift. My way of thanks. Gee. You were on a roll, by your man. I entrust to you one of my closest companions, the Telling Stone. His knowledge of our world rivals even my own. I thought he might help you on your journey. I'm sure if you ask him nicely, he will tell you anything you wish to know. And the other thing, the locket. This is what you came here for, is it not? It is a vessel for fragments of the human heart. To rescue the heartbroken, you will need the locket and the spells required to use it. I will give you those as well. Thank you oh, so, so much, oh, so Old giving. Father Oak. Hmm. Such a well-mannered child. Unlike some I could mention. What? I, all right, all right. Ta, bad face. Hmm. Some things are as unchanging as the forest. No matter. You had best be on your way. Now, boy. You must come and see me from time to time. And tell me of your travels. I look forward to hearing of your progress. Mm-hmm. 
Yes, sir. Let's be off, shall we? We shall. Time to head back to Ding Dong Dell and mend a broken heart. Okay. I like how we've just got this slab with us now. Telling Tone is now accessible from the main menu. We obtained a locket. Take heart. And see if the thing it give heart. Nice. So we should. The telling stone, what does that do? Life lessons. Talking points of view. Okay, so this basically will just do us all of the all the tutorials here. Uh, I will go through these to make sure. Creature Compodium, or so this one's we know. A mite. To read eleven of those, one of those jabbers, five spatoes. That's why I got up to in the Saints when you've seen me. Habitat, the deep dark wood. There's three here. The rolling hills, there's some here. This is miscellaneous species. Interesting. And then genus. So we have Melites, Beasties, Aquaticas, Aves, which is birds, uh, Vermes, Flora, Automana, Minima is mini things, Nympha, Dracones, oh, these little dragons, Arcana, Demonia, Nobilia, and there must be big boys, and then Mortui. Okay, good to know. Dangerous places, the Dictar Wood, we've got three. We don't know how many blues there are, but there's none of the others. We always saw one blue for sure. And we're this far on our Compodium, which is good to know. Right. And then lastly, the locket. A few pieces of heart you have gathered. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Uh, in the lineup. We haven't got any treats for you right now, but... We did learn a new spell. Are we going to have to? Yes, we do. We have to make sure we give you the Sand Blast to do. Uh, okay. And with so, we head back towards Ding Dong Dell. But there is some stuff I know in the outside world that I've yet to receive or get. So I'd like to make sure I grab them. Just make our way out of the old woods. Now, as we did once note, there was the sparkly things. You can see that sparkly thing on top of the buildings there. We're actually going to be aiming for is trying. There's some. There's the opportunity. As you notice, there's two of these now. Let's do a mighty. Let's do a sandblast just to see it. Nice. All fairly simple for Mighty to deal with. We need to experience, though. How oh, very, very sad. Right. There is, basically, uh... So, I would like to get on top of there. I think that's what I'm aiming for. I think that's what I'm meant to be aiming for. But we're going to... I basically... There's a chance I can get a sword. We can do this! Here it goes. We're just going to fight generally with Mighty for a bit. Especially as none of what's out here seems to be too troublesome for us. Take him out. Boom, boom, boom. Some plain, more plain towards flowers. Is it up here that I'm mean, meaning to be looking? I don't think I'm strong enough to get up there yet. That's the only issue. It's the only issue I can see, even though there is this. With the Ouroboros, so maybe I have to go up here and round here. It feels like there should be some sparkly stuff here. They're running away from me already, which is a good sign, I think. Oh, 
a tainted giant's tooth. That was not what I was expecting. Oh, well, I mean, I'll take it for sure. It doesn't like a giant's tooth. Okay, so some of these things that I'm looking for are not spiky. They just are. Okay. I need to make sure that I'm pressing A of the opportunity. What does a giant's tooth do? Ah. Gives, gives us plus one attack, which to be honest is most useful. But old. Oh, we can't even do it for you here. He can't even attach this, so let's can't give Ollie a bit of a giant's tooth to go across. Okay, we can see some, oh, there's a shiny up here, so let's grab that. Make sure we fight everything along the way. Minor birds. I think just giving him once he's got stamina makes sense. Well, a gig, it's slightly annoying, but it's not too. Can we get uh, the MP back anyway? Okay, what's this got? What's this? Some pains bought flowers. Determined to, uh, because I think there's weapons that I've missed out on basically. But retracing my steps will be difficult. So, let's try and figure out what this one is. This is. Should give us more spring water? It does, indeed, right. Okay, we'll fight, fight the birds. Fight everyone, everyone will mighty for now. Especially when you can make such short work on them. And to be honest, getting a little, a little backbone of money is not a bad idea. So I'm looking for a rock formation. Once again, Mighty is going to be the key here. With the spells, we've got really fear. No one. And we get some free booster shots anyway, yeah, because I always like to do a little like, recollection. So, okay, we're going to have to fight everything, it seems. There is no, there's no, uh, there's no way around. Grab that and then grab, make sure we grab this one. Nice. Okay. Here's a rock formation of water. I think this is where I'm meant to be going. Ah, here it is. Supple leather. This is not exactly what I wanted. I think there might be more around here. Is this where I'm meant to be going? Watch this. Here go. In our mission to find things. Mighty needs the leveling up anyway. So I'm not complaining. Right, is it here? Is it around here there should be something? Here it is, nice. 
a well-worn sword. Okay, that's ultimately what I wanted. Now, can you equip this? Basic sword, plus six to his damage. We'll definitely take that. And then let's see what the... Nice. And then this is a basic sword. Call me some ding-dong-dale. Nice, nice, nice. I'll take everything. Okay, and then up here in our mission round, there was more stuff. We'll find the bar bar. Watch this! Here goes! My god, now Mighty's got this sword. Mighty is as mu more mighty than imaginable. take it. Right in here, there is a nice coffee, which is always going to be handy for us. Okay. So, let's head back to Ding Dong Dell. And there's still more things I'm going to collect uh, along our way. There's, a, there's some swords and some sundays. But maybe I won't, I won't uh, bore you with showing you guys that. Boom. Nice. We get a pie though for your boy, so let's go ahead and give your boy a pie. Nice. Is accuracy increased by a point? We'll take that mighty. Alright, towards Ding Dong Dale. And I think, actually, this is probably quite a good point to say, if you've enjoyed this, uh, please like and subscribe. I will see you guys next time, where we head to Ding Dong Dale and see our guys away. Okay, these things are ruthless and just want to fight all the time, apparently. Um, yeah, I will see you guys there. But we'll go ahead and get our just rewards, should we say. We'll try and give our heart to the gentleman and go around Ding Dong Dale for the Let's first go. time. Um, I'm basically just going to go around with Mighty now and smack people up. Come on, attack me. Nice. Bam. My god, the asleep is annoying. Especially when this thing's accuracy is so fucking awful. I'll take the free heal though. Okay. I will. Yeah, I'm basically going to get. There's a Sunday that you can get. There's a wooden sword, etc., etc., in the roaming hills. So I'm going to make sure I grab all of these things. Um, and then I'll see you guys next time. Adding Dong Dale. Peace and love.